Let me introduce you to David Newman. I'm showing you his LinkedIn profile. One thing is I can read this whole like a profile. You don't want me to do it. Why not you go ahead and find him on LinkedIn and add him as a connection so that way you can start learning just like I started learning from him. Welcome to our show. Here, thank you again for inviting me. Oh, it's our pleasure. How much, so how do you really answer? I know that you have a 17 answer to this question. How much do you charge? The three answers that you don't want to give you don't want to give some random answer. For example, a lot of people, a lot of salespeople and, and marketing people and a lot of entrepreneurs, they say, well, on average, it costs X. And the average, no one cares about the average. They say, hey, how much is this going to cost for me, for my situation, for what I want to fix, for what I want to solve, for what I want to buy? So don't quote some random number. Don't quote a range. Don't quote the average. Don't quote any of that. Number two is don't act surprised or don't be caught off guard by that question. Expect the question to come at the wrong time. Expect the question to come too early. Expect the question to come at an awkward moment during that conversation and then be prepared for it. And then the third thing not to do is don't get defensive. Don't start to, def to uh, defend your price or say, well, it's it's seventeen thousand dollars, but that's because, or it's you know it's five thousand dollars, but I can work with you, which means you've got no pricing pricing integrity, and that you're willing to negotiate down to zero, and then that gets the prospect thinking, how low can we go? So just don't do those three things. Reframe the question as a positive, and then we'll go through all the specific answers. That some of them are funny, and some of them are very relevant. And some of them get the prospect focused back on where they should be focused, which is on solving their problem. So someone says, hey, David, how much is it? I say, well, if it works, it's cheap. If it doesn't, it's expensive. And the, the reason I say that, number one, it's true. <laughs> right? <laughs> if it works, it's cheap. If it doesn't work, it's expensive. Um, it's, it shows that it's a collaboration. So I could be the world's greatest marketing consultant, marketing speaker, marketing mentor. If you don't implement anything that I, I teach and I show you, and I'm very, very specific, what to say, how to say it, what to do, how to do it, but you don't lift a finger and you've paid me eight, ten, twelve, fifteen thousand dollars, whatever it might be, that is the, the dumbest money you've ever spent. If you don't implement, if it doesn't work, and all my programs, Sadiq, have a 1,000% guarantee. It sounds like this. I 1,000% guarantee that all the strategies and tactics that you do not implement will not generate results. Oh, I love it. That's my 1,000% guarantee. I've, I've never seen that fail. I've never had to give anybody 1,000% of their money back. You know, If they didn't implement, it will not work. Uh, but if it works, if they keep up their end of the bargain, and any salesperson, any marketer, any entrepreneur, any consultant understands that any sort of sale is a partnership. I sell it to you, but you have to use it, leverage it, install it, maintain it. You know, you, you have to take care of it, uh, and, and you have to act and implement on your end of the bargain. Uh, if you don't do that, it's going to be too expensive. Even if it's $10, it's too expensive. You know, if it's a million dollars and it solves a $50 million problem, it's cheap. So it's, again, that context setting of let's not talk about the price, let's talk about the outcome. So you're still watching this? That really means you like the answer given by David Newman. And that was just one of the answers. You just got it. And there are 16 more answers to that question. You know, you remember the question? How much do you charge? Imagine that having a 17 possible answers to that single question when you get from your prospect to buyer or you know, a customer or a client, whatever you call it. I have recorded a one hour interview one to one with him and I want to give you all. What you have to do is take your cell phone out. Here's how my cell phone look like. It's an old iPhone and you don't have to have an iPhone. You can be Android phone or even an old fashioned simple phone where you, which can send text and which I'm aware of worldwide everybody can send a text from the cell phones. What you have to do is take that cell phone out and send a text message to this number. You see there's a number called 404418 six zero one nine again four zero four four one eight six zero one nine 
when you send a message in a message put a word charge c h a r g e you see it here you know i'm showing you everything in case for some reason where i'm pointing my finger that you don't see it let me show you the old fashioned way you see this text charge to 404 418 6019 if you are texting from outside of us or canada you may have to do a plus 1 on the front or maybe 011 whatever is your country from your country how you make a call to us you are not calling you are going to text it plus 1 404 418 6019 when you are texting to this number the word charge you are giving me a permission to call you or text you myself my team or my system thank you so much i look forward to connecting with you soon 